Hey yo, what's good? It's your boy Tickets. Welcome back to the channel. If you guys are new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button and also the bell button next to it so you are notified every time I post a video. And also before we start, make sure to give this video a thumbs up because today I'm going to be giving you guys three crucial tips on what you're doing wrong as a sneakerhead. And the first thing is you don't have a sneaker rotation. You probably only have one type of shoe and those are your sneakers. You don't have your casual shoes. You don't have your dress shoes. All you have is sneakers. You have your Jordans and your Hype Adidas, but you don't... <coughs> Whoa. But you don't have these to dress a little classy in sometimes, or you don't have these to keep it a little casual, but you have a bunch of these. You need to have a sneaker rotation for different events, such as a family party or a business event, or let's say you're going to the mall and you need some heat, so that's why you have these as well. Or maybe you just want to flex, so you gotta have one of these in your collection. Also, if you play sports, you gotta have sneakers for that sport, such as basketball shoes. I got some soccer shoes over there. Just in case, you never know, I don't even play soccer like that. I do have those in case my friends ever invite me to go out and play. So you, got, so you have to make sure you have different types of shoes, not just sneakers, and they don't all have to be expensive. Expensive. They can be cheap. However, you just need to have a rotation I know I showed some expensive shoes, but that's just what's in my collection Your collection doesn't have to be the same The second thing you guys are doing wrong is wearing baggy jeans with slim shoes So for example, you guys are wearing regular fit jeans with these types of sneakers with these types of sneakers And that just does not look right baggy jeans cover half of this sneaker baggy jeans are only meant for big bulky sneakers Which is what the trend is more leaning towards now So you could rock baggy jeans with basketball sneakers because basketball sneakers are pretty bulky So for example the Jordan 3s like I showed earlier Jordan 1s are another good example. However, I see these a little more on the slim side since they are pretty thin sneakers. But a good example out of all the sneakers I have right now is the Yeezy Blush. This is a dad shoe. Clearly, that's where the sneaker culture is going. That's why you have these releasing. And also, Nike made an Air Monarch V2 pretty much. The point is to stop wearing baggy jeans with these types of sneakers that are very thin. They're very slim to the foot. They just do not look right. They look stupid and you look like a fool. It doesn't mean you have to wear skinny jeans. It just means you might have to go a little slimmer on your jean fit. And that also ties back to tip number one because if you're gonna have a shoe rotation, you might as well have a jean rotation as well. Last but not least, moving on to the third thing you're doing wrong as a sneakerhead is that you're letting the sneaker be the outfit. This is actually very common amongst beginner sneakerheads, I guess you can call it. <laughs> I don't even know if this thing is a beginner sneakerhead. But my point is that when you get into the sneaker game, you just think about the sneakers only and you don't think about the clothing that goes along with it. And just because you have fire ass sneakers, like you can have some fire Yeezys, but if you have a crappy clothing and you don't style it right, it's just gonna look bad. And this pretty much ties back to tip number one and two. You gotta have a shoe rotation, you gotta have a jean rotation, and I guess have a style rotation overall depending on the type of sneakers that you wear. I'm not gonna lie, the way I used to style my clothing was based off my sneakers, especially when my sneaker collection was a lot smaller. I would buy outfits in regards to the sneaker fit and also the sneaker colors. So for example, if I had to make an outfit for these, I'd probably buy some blue jeans or some black jeans, and maybe just a plain gray shirt and let the sneakers stand out and make my whole outfit pop. Because the sneaker is supposed to complement your outfit, it's not supposed to make your whole outfit. If you guys did enjoy these tips, Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also, make sure to hit that subscribe button right down here and turn your notifications on so you don't miss out on any future videos. I know if you're watching this video, you're most likely a sneakerhead. And even if you're not, leave a comment down below and let me know which one of these three mistakes you've done in the past. I'm pretty sure you've done at least one of them because everybody has, including me. Anyways, today's fan of the day does go to Hector Lemma. If you want to be fan of the day, all you have to do is leave a positive comment down below. Anyways, guys, till next time, make sure you guys keep grinding. It's your boy, Sneaker Signing Now.